Arsenal fan TV, had you heard of Eddie Nketiah before tonight? Yeah. What? I do watch what goes Did you, on. Did, when he came on, mm. now I want you to be 100% honest now. When he came on, mm -hmm. you know, with five minutes ago, what was you thinking? Uh, why was it not Walcott that went off? But did you think... <laughs> but hold on, did you think he'd come on and, and, and be able to do anything? No, I don't think no one thought that he was going to come on and mm. have the impact he did. You're lying if you think that. Mm. Um, but yeah, that was my actual thought. Why is Theo still on the pitch? Mm. Theo needs to take a long, hard look in the mirror and be embarrassed by himself. Mm. It's as simple as that. At the end of the day, he's been showed up by a kid that's never started a game for us. Mm. He was so direct and, you know, just the enthusiasm and everything he had. Even Chuba, mm. he was more direct. Mm. You know, and they showed up the senior players. I said to you last week when we was out in Serbia, I didn't realise who the senior player was out of Walcott and Reese Nelson and Joe Willock and them. Mm. Again, some of them senior players, they need to go and take a long, hard look at themselves. Mm. And I wouldn't. I, Walcott's our captain tonight. Really? We're by the Thierry Henry statue and he's wearing his number. That's a joke, man. It's a joke. The guy's on 140 grand a week. Nah, sorry, mate. Mm. Do you know what I mean? I thought Dubucci done well tonight. He's yeah. actually starting to earn his wages. That's, that's, that's two games in a row yeah. as well that he's yeah. done very well. Yeah, he's done really um, well. Is he, you know, going to be knocking on the door soon yeah, for, to start? Yeah, he will be. He will be knocking on the door. He got, what, 120 minutes under his belt tonight, mm. 90 last week. And he looks decent. So it's good to have, for Hector to have a bit of competition because he hasn't had any. Mm. So that's good. Um, but yeah, apart from that, I just, I'm just i so annoyed that Reese Nelson still keeps getting played out of position because I still we haven't seen mm. what we know he's got. You know? What we're seeing at the moment, though, is that there are some good young, yep. talented players yep. at Arsenal. That, you know, like you said, they showed up a lot of the senior players today yeah. and they got that hunger. And not only have they got hunger, mm. they've got a fair amount of ability and skill that you look at them and you say, listen, you can, you know, Arsenal Wenger will be looking at these players and say, mm. I can trust these guys to come in and do a job. But will he really trust them? Will he go and put them on the bench? Will he throw them on in Premier League games? You know, uh, I would go as far as saying that I would start some of them, including Eddie, um, in the game next Thursday mm. when we got Red Star here. Yeah. You know, mm. but yeah, I ain't got a problem with Giroud, mm. you know. I had a chat with him yesterday, he's a nice guy actually. Mm. Um, but he isn't doing anything when he's playing at the moment. But at the same time, I do think that we're not playing to him. Mm. You know, we're trying to put through balls. What, what, what are you watching? When has Giroud ever had pace? So why are you playing through balls? Mm. You know, and it's get the ball into the box and cross it. Because that's where his strength is. So it, at the mm. same time, I do think that... It, then, players around him are not playing to his strength mm. but it's a bit difficult putting a cross in the box when you've got Walcott trying to cross it in you mm. we've got rid of Ox and we've basically got another one <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Wilshire tonight mm. um, you know again he's got um, minutes out there yeah he, w he was uh, doing some good things uh, a, bit, a little bit sloppy at times but yep. did also do some very good things out there I mean it's, it's looking good to have yeah. this guy back in the team as well he's knocking on the door isn't he Mm. at the end of the day and it's just <laughs> you know you look at the performance at Everton it was really really good so that mm. ain't going to change on Saturday mm. as much as we want Jack to start um, it isn't going to change we know well, what he, he won't start after no. after the, the, the amount of minutes he's done yeah, tonight but yeah. it's encouraging yeah it is because you, you know we know how much ability he's got and how much talent he's mm. got but it's about fitness and that's the only thing that's ever been the downfall of Jack Wilshere but mm. if he keeps doing what he's doing then he's going to get that start in place soon enough but mm. you know like I said tonight it was nice to see some of the youngsters. It was nice for them to come out here and show what they can do. And it's nice for the fans that, you know, because at one point at 85 minutes, I was looking around and there was loads of kids here tonight. Mm. And I'm thinking, how many of these are here for their first time? And they were watching that. And let's be real, for 85 minutes, that was shit. If you was a kid, you'd walk away from here and probably go and support Tottenham. <laughs> <laughs> do you know what I mean? Let's be real. That's how shit we were for 85 minutes. We were awful. And it took the youngsters to turn around and say, listen, you lot, fix the fuck up. Why are we coming and digging you out of a hole? But they did. And we move on to Saturday and we get to see some of the main guys back. Ozil, Alexis. Maybe you should play Eddie instead. Nah, mate. <laughs> Ozil, Lacazette. Oh, and yeah. Eddie. Oh, no, you know what I go home and do when them guys play, man? <laughs> do you know what I mean? <laughs> Keep <laughs> yourself, we mate. ain't getting into that hey, one, but... <laughs> The Ultimate Football Fan is now here. Listen, if you want the best content, things like Blood Brothers, exclusive content only here from Arsenal Fan TV, you've got to check out the Ultimate Football Fan. Go to the Indiegogo link, 
be one of the first to get on board with this. Arsenal Fan TV are live on here, ultimate football fan.